So Abby, what are we doing today? We're building a laminar flow fountain. Oh, that sounds pretty cool. What do we got here? All right, got 400 drinking straws. We've got PVC caps, a big PVC tube, an adapter for the hose, some metal mesh, and scouring pads. I'm gonna put this all together and make us a fountain. We're gonna cut it to get some rings. Get it up there, come on, man. We're making two rings and then cutting them so they fit inside the tube. We're now cutting the mesh to fit inside the tube. The mesh is there to keep the straws in place. The straws are to organize the water into laminar flow. We're now drilling an input for the hose. And gluing the hose adapter to the input. Wait, what? Give that 10 minutes. Okay. Or a stick. All right, Abby is now gluing the mesh in place. All right, Abby is now cutting the scouring pads to distribute the water evenly and to break up the flow. And it's not gluing in place, right? Scouring pads going in here. This one. Let me go down and PVC it, and then you shove it down on it, okay? Screen, here we go. Stick it down on that stuff. Drilling an output hole. Straight on. Oh, the Z man. Oh! <laughs> I didn't need the tip of that portion or bit anyway. I was gonna make sure that hole is super smooth. Test number one attaching the hose. Eric, I don't want my shoes to be soaked. <laughs> More turbulent the farther you get down. Yeah, see that. Yeah, see that? We're now cutting the tube to make it more compact. We figured a test cap would be better as an output. That's pretty good. That's better, huh? That's way better. You got it? Laminar flow. Pretty good, right? Yeah. Can you see it on camera? Yes. I'm getting pretty wet, but look at that. It was a hard, tough battle, but we did it. Uh, Finally, yeah. in the end. David was instrumental to getting laminar flow. Yeah, for it, us. it was a rough ride, but thank you, David. Done now. <laughs> thank you for hours of service. <laughs>